Hello, my name is Jennifer Satya Shapiro, and people call me Satya. My website is jensatya, J-E-N-S-A-T-Y-A dot com. And today I'm going to talk to you about how to potentize your homeopathic remedy. As a homeopath for over two decades now, I often use liquid remedies with my clients, and I use them for two main reasons. One is a liquid remedy I can potentize, and I'm going to explain that in this video, I can potentize the remedy to get more specific on dosing and to gently increase dose over time without having to give them a different remedy. And two is I find, especially for my sensitive clients, that liquid dosing potentized certain ways is much gentler to the system, especially on the initial dosing. So those are the two main reasons that I use liquid remedies. Now, potentizing a remedy is very easy to understand. It basically means that we hit the remedy or shake it a certain way to wake it up, and we do it a certain number of times to gently increase the dose. So I'm going to show you what I mean. So this is a homeopathic remedy, and the remedy is Nux Vomica. It was made this morning. And what we're going to do is with the liquid remedy, we first take the remedy by the top. Now we do not take it by the dropper because you start shaking something by the dropper and it's going to go all over the place. You want to take your two fingers, wrap them around so your hand's holding the remedy. Take your thumb, bring it around the front so you've got a good hold below the cap. Open the other hand wide and hit the remedy the number of potentizations. So if I have three potentizations, I'm going to go one, two, three. And that's potentizing the remedy three times. Now, a second way to potentize remedies, which is actually not the way I offer usually to my clients, because I find the hand potentizing is a lot easier for them. But some of my clients that learn this way will grab the cap this way, and instead of hitting it against the hand, they'll shake it down like a thermometer. One, two, three. And that's another way to potentize the remedy. So just to recap, we can pick up the remedy and potentize it against our hand. One, two, three. Or we can pick it up and shake it down like a thermometer. One, two, three. And we won't be doing the shaking of the remedy. One, two, three, because that confuses the energy of the remedy. I hope this was helpful. Please let me know if you have any questions or suggestions. And again, my name is Jennifer Satya Shapiro. My website is jensatya.com, and I hope you subscribe. Blessings.